Hello and welcome, Chef Pennington here. Today we are going to be covering some amazing food items, but one in particular is like the master of them all. It has the number one antioxidant in the world that you may have never heard of. But first, which one of these do you guys think is the healthiest thing on the screen? And I'll tell you, chia seeds are close, but it's not chia seeds, believe it or not. We are going to talk about the master antioxidant of all of them. It's called glutathione. Now, this is not a big, long tutorial about it, but just a little information about it, which makes this food great. It's a powerful antioxidant. It's the most protective molecule in your body. You need it. Your liver makes it, but you need to get it from food, and it's not as easy to get. This is going to help you end up not having a stroke, Alzheimer's, heart disease. It's a really serious business here. It'll give you more energy. Your skin's going to look beautiful. Healthy doctor detoxification it's good for your brain and you can possibly even live longer now let's talk about breakfast at its finest glutathione it's broccoli guys and we're gonna make it good so don't trust me it's gonna be delicious i eat it every single day um but we're gonna make it in a way where it's delicious and you want to eat it this comes from a whole foods recipe i love going to whole foods i like eating breakfast there just you know there's a ton of stuff prepared that you're just not going to do for yourself well they had something on their menu called broccoli crunch and i started eating it and i really liked it the texture, we're going to add good stuff here that's going to make it not so broccoli, you might say. But it has the master antioxidant, which is a master for a reason. It's the strongest. It's so important for your body that, you know, there's, it's hard to get everywhere else in food. And like I said, your liver makes it, and it's not in a lot of foods. But it's in every single cell in nature, which makes it pretty interesting. So we need to find foods to eat to get more of it. If we want to be super healthy, and I think most of you guys are watching this video, you really care. And you're probably like me. You're always trying to find one extra thing to eat that's going to allow you to be super healthy. Well, broccoli for breakfast is it, guys. It's the most important meal of the day. We all know that. But the reason why is the interesting part. It's not because you need to eat and brain power, which is what most people would think, and that is true. But it's because you've been sleeping all night, and your body's been working so hard while you sleep that Eating a good breakfast refills your body. It fills up all those, I guess, goodies inside that you used while you were sleeping. So here's a cool ingredient, guys. Dried figs. Whenever the recipe comes together, I like to put in a plastic bag and let it sit in my refrigerator. The figs kind of soften a little bit, and it takes on a really nice little sweet flavor. It runs through it, which helps counterbalance the broccoli, you know? This is really good. Chia seeds, superfood. Awesome. I wrote a really good article talking about chia seeds and why you should eat it. The link will be below. I really suggest you check that out. We all know garlic is great for us. And that garlic salt has salt, which salt is electrolyte. We need that in your body. It's one of the five electrolytes. Without salt, you're going to die. So a little salt's good for us. Plus salt brings flavor. We're happy about that. We're all into yogurt these days. If you all know of a higher fat content yogurt, please leave me a comment below because I can't find it. You know, the keto kind of mindset. I'm not really keto, but I'm kind of curious about it. But I can't ever find a good yogurt. So please let me know, guys. Broccoli Crunch, guys. It's so easy, so good. Come join us on social media. We'd love to have you guys over there. While you're here, go ahead and subscribe. And please hit the like button if you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to have a link below. It's going to come back to our website, which will have the recipe and all the kind of other cool little greens you can add to it. And y'all have the best. Take care.